that Bella really wants to. They've got some. Hello and welcome back to my channel. My name is Jess, also known as the Fat Funny One. And hello, I am going to take you around with me today for a little bit of a vlog. You can hear JJ showering in the background. He's playing in his room. I'm going to deal with all of this. Hmm, fun. So we are in that in between. No, we're not. No, we're not. I was going to say we're doing Christmas and New Year, but we're not. What day is it today? I think it's Sunday. It's Sunday. <laughs> I have no idea. So normally on a Sunday we have a reset day. Um, so I'm resetting the house. Can you hear Trevor? He's watching a video um, on his phone. Um, so I'm going to sort out all the laundry and stuff. We also went to Trevor's parents. Cute the dog because he always barks when I do videos. Um, went to Trevor's parents' house for a few days, so the luggage from there is still here. So I've got to organise all that, get the washing done. Uh, we're going to take the kids out for a walk down by the river. We live near a river, which is really nice. Take the dog out. They've got some ducks that Bella really wants to feed, so we're going to go down there. I've got to nip to Lidl and just get a few bits for the week, but we've pretty much stocked up on food because I did that massive shop, which you probably would have saw in my last vlog. So I've only got to get a few fresh fruit and veg, um, but everything else is fine. We don't need much else, um, and I'm determined to stick to budget this month. So yeah, that's it. So come along with us, have a look at just a kind of a reset Sunday, um, a bit of a lazy one. I'm watching Chicago Med. So yeah, come along with me. Um, Let's get started. This one will not nap. Oh, mommy, we're yeah. going far away. Where are we going? Feed the ducks. We're going to go feed the ducks, aren't we? Yeah. Why did you just ask me about my jeans? It's just ripped jeans. It's just ripped jeans. You weren't sure what happened to them, were you? Yeah. Ella was like, what's happened to your jeans? What's happened to your jeans? I was... I was... <laughs> This is my daddy. This is my daddy. <laughs> That's what she said. She was like, this is my daddy. Huh? Said dad. That's your dad? Yeah. Oh, you don't say daddy anymore? No. Oh, right. Okay. Well, I'm going to put the baby in a sling because I think that's the only way we're going to get anything done today. Um, I'm watching Chicago Med. Obsessed with it. Like, literally obsessed with it. So I'm trying to um, convince everyone to go for a walk. No one wants to go. So I'm going to make some lunch. Um, also, I need to take the reef down off the front door. Also, <laughs> this is completely broken. I took a coat off it. Um, it was here when we moved in. It's like a coat hook. And I took a coat off it and pulled it. And basically, um, yeah. That happened. You're gonna make some lunch. Trevor just got back from the shops. I sent him in the end because um, it was easier and I needed to feed the baby. So I'll show you what I got. So I have been craving some like Caesar salads. So I've got Trevor to get me some lettuce and just some little sacks and um, some parmesan. I think he got some chicken, some lettuce, and then a Caesar dressing. That is just the pan heating up because I'm about to make lunch. I'm gonna make some pasta. We've got some bananas, some raisins, JJ loves raisins and a bag like this is cheaper than the little boxes that I got last time and pretty much most of those are finished. Some grapes, some yogurts, Trevor must have got nourishment, um, some ham for some sandwiches for like lunches in the week, some bagels, eggs, more eggs, we like eggs, uh, pita breads again for sandwiches and some blueberries. So just a quick weekly shop, um, yeah lunch i'm gonna do pasta the kids want pasta they'll probably have pesto pasta that's like their fave um i filled out the family board um so that's all done uh and then yeah i'm also gonna make for dinner i'm gonna do a slow cooker curry i bought these i think they're in the last haul that i did like in the last vlog like a slow cooker curry sauce thing and i think you just add 
what does it say? I think you just add some tin tomatoes. Um, but I'm actually going to do it. I've just defrosted some diced lamb. So we're going to have it with lamb instead of chicken. So I'm going to chuck that in now. Although I've left it a bit late because it is... Oh, it's telling me to breathe. It is five to two. And I'm not sure how long. That says... In this, oh, four hours. Five to two. Six. Okay, that should be fine. So I've just done a post on Instagram and everyone's asking about my jeans. So these, oh, you can't even see. Oh, like, yeah, I can't. These are the jeans. <laughs> this is this is why. Jess, oh, the dog. Jess is not a fashion blogger. Um, but they are super comfortable. They like. I've got them in a short size because I'm short. And they've got like little rips on. Can you see? Trevor's laughing at me. Why don't you do one of those things where like you have them out and then you slap them on you like that? A transition video. Yeah, where you go, bam, see? These are the jeans uh, and all that. Are you listening to this? I should be like creative director. Uh, hopefully you got the gist of um, that. those jeans. Uh, I'll link them below. <laughs> While I'm here, I'll show you a couple of other bits. I'm clearly really low down because our window ledge is really low down um, and I can't find my tripod. So I'm going to show you a few other bits I got from Simply B. So I got, I don't know why, I'm, I don't know why I thought this would be nice, but it is quite cute. But I've got this top, um, and it's got the really cute, like, what's it called? I don't know what that's called, but that little collar thing. Anyway, I've got that. There was obviously a theme, uh, because I've got another top <laughs> with the same collar, which is really cute, but it's like a jumper. But I wanted to go bright, 2022. All about you we're going bright so i thought i'd get this she says i think everything else in the pile is dark but anyway <laughs> these they're like just jersey fabric bootleg who doesn't love a bootleg but i'm really short so i reckon they're gonna be really long but they are super stretchy and look super comfy and they've got pockets pockets so i'm gassed so i'm gonna probably wear these quite a bit so I've got these, and I can't actually find uh, what else I've bought. I can't find it. But I'm only opening it today because uh, we were away at Trevor's parents, so I've only just got my delivery today. And I'm loving all of the stuff, especially the jeans that I'm wearing now. Um, they're called, I just checked, they're called the Chloe Ripped Jeans, and I'm wearing them in a size 18 short. But I probably could have got a 16, because um, they are they are stretchy. They're stretchy everywhere but 2022 i'm going for comfort 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 and i thought let's go for a comfort one because at least if i eat or drink which is probably uh, almost 100 percent guaranteed then i've got something comfortable to wear yeah so the boys are asleep having a nap trevor's having a shower the girls are watching a film i'm going to use this time to what am i going to do do some home admin i've got to book the kids back into all of their like clubs and renew terms and do all of that good stuff i've got to quickly update our budgets um and get that all set i've got i went to the cash point well i didn't go trevor went to the cash point so i can stuff our cash envelopes um for the month and stuff like that so yeah i'm gonna crack on with that and then i've got dinner cooking in the slow cooker that lamb curry and i'm gonna lay all the kids pajamas out um, and get that all ready for bath time so we can start getting back into the routine for school this week nobody really goes back to kind of the back end of the week but yeah let's keep it moving let's keep it going i really shouldn't have knelt down because <laughs> <sighs> my knees my knees i just went in the garage and the dog came with me and well yeah what a day to wear white a eh? so i'm just going to quickly show you my cash wallet um i did get request on instagram for a budget video um which i will do eventually um but it's this one i'll link it below i bought it from etsy from a small business called made by sarah mary sarah sarah mary i can't remember i'll link it below um but i love it um, and i'll show you how I do it really briefly because it's not my method so I follow the budget mum I've got her I'll show you so this is the planner that I use it's from the budget mum I 
Dory. I've got the Peony, Peony ones, whatever. Um, and then I have the Zebra Highlighters, which I swear by for journaling, bullet journaling, budgeting, everything. I'll link them below. I bought these off Amazon. It's like a massive um, case of like every colour. And then I have, I labelled them into the different categories of like my budget categories. And then this is the wallet I've got. Um, she had really good reviews and she could personalise them. She can then personalise all of your wallets, but I changed my categories. So I ended up just printing them on my um, labeler. As you can see, I've got some cash up to stuff. Um, but our food budget for the month is £200. We've got lots of leftovers from Christmas. We really want to clear the freezer. Um, so that's what it is. So every time we do a shop, um, I'll just write down what we spent and then how much is left. So yesterday we went to Tesco, so actually we forgot quite a bit. So Trevor went back today and that's it now for the week. So um, that's what it looks like. And then I do the same for all of my categories. And the little slips, like these little slips, I, I think I bought these or they might have been a free download from the budget mum. Print them off and then cut them out and stick them in. So I've printed a bunch here and I'll keep them like in the edge of here um, to put in every month. Now, obviously, doing your budget and stuff is far more complicated than this. This is just like a little snippet of what I do. Um, but when we're really trying to rein in our spending, because I can go a few months of being really, really good and then just going completely off piste and spending whatever, and that's not, not good for anyone. So yeah, um, I always come back to this method. I've used the journal. This is my third journal so i bought the first budget by paycheck book a couple of years ago and then i bought her small set of workbooks and um, i really didn't like the workbooks not because they were there was anything wrong with them but i didn't like how small they were and um, i just prefer having a big workbook that i can work through write bigger and all of that stuff and the work it, the workbook the small ones um the box set that's it. The box set that she does um, is exactly the same content. The content's not any different. I literally just prefer the bigger size book. So I went back to the bigger size book. You can do the digital version. I did do the digital. Actually, it must have been my fourth now. So I did the digital download one year and I printed it all off and put it in my own folder. Um, and that was really, really good. But I just really like the book. So I've gone back to it. So yeah, I'm going to quickly stuff those envelopes, fill out my little, my little paper slip things uh, before the kids wake up and the film finishes um and that's it the other thing I'm trying to drink loads of water i know every year i'm like i'm gonna drink more water but i bought this off amazon and it's a 2.2 litre bottle i bought one for trevor for christmas as well and i'm definitely not where i need to be Confidence. My girl, we run like hips and toes, but sip on it. Take a trip on it. When a girl who can go slow, wind it up all night. Baby, take your time. record i've got the camera to do the last little bit of our vlog to say i'm hiding in the kitchen to eat dinner because the second i go anywhere near the baby with a hot bowl of food he wants feed and i went out of the room by the time i came back trevor was like the baby's awake and wants a feed 
I can also hear the girls arguing. Just it's at that point. I don't know if anyone else's house between like, I don't know, from 6 p.m. onwards, it's just until bed. Everyone's tired and whiny, and we try and do really chill things, watch a film, read a book, play some music, but yeah. Anyway, I'm gonna sign off now. Um, but yeah, I've done most of the stuff for today. I've written a to-do list for tomorrow as well. Um, laid all the kids, <laughs> laid all the kids' pajamas and stuff out. So tonight after dinner, everyone will just get washed into bed, um, and then hopefully get some sleep. So thank you for watching. Um, yeah, don't forget to like and subscribe. Take care. Bye.